Hello everybody, this is Mr. Galvan. Today, I'm gonna to discuss how to use the pin feature in Google Meet. So, when you're in a Google Meet session, you might have many people in the Meet, including your teacher. So it's important that you want to keep your teacher as the focus of your screen so that you can see clearly what they're trying to show you and explain to you on their screen. Okay, so to make their screen the feature, let's pretend that this one on the left is our teacher's screen, okay? And we need to have it be big, so it's the focus. Right now, I have two other screens uh, that I can see. So I want this one to be the main one, the big one. So if you move your mouse, you can see that there are a couple of icons that appear. In particular, this one. It's kind of like a thumbtack. Uh, we call it the pin, okay? So as it says, it says pin to screen. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna click on it, just a regular click. When you do, now that screen has become big. It is the main focus of uh, what your screen is. So you can now see very clearly what is on the screen. To unpin it or to go back to the previous view, all you have to do is hover over it again and notice there's a little icon, but this time the thumbtack has the line through it. This is how you unpin the screen to go back to normal. Just a regular click and we're back to normal, back to the two screens. So one more time, hover over the display and click on the thumbtack icon. This will make the teacher's screen big. Okay, so again, we're pretending that this one is the teacher's screen and we're clicking on the thumbtack icon. And now this one is big. It's the main video feed that we are seeing on our screen. Okay, guys, hopefully this helps. Make sure that you always follow this whenever the teacher wants to share their screen and particularly when they wanna share something uh, like on a document camera or a video or anything like that. All right, I hope this helps.